I don't say this very much in features, but uh, I need to get out of this thing. <laughs> Dude, this thing is terrifying. What's up guys, Javier from That Racing Channel. Welcome back to another one. Today we have a special treat for our Honda fans. You guys will know this car right behind me, Danny, AKA Frustrate, and his all-wheel drive Honda that makes north of 1,300 all-wheel horsepower. Let's go check it out. Danny, what's up, brother? What's up? Thanks for having me out here, man. Welcome back, bro. It's, it's been it's been a long time coming, and and quite a while since we've seen this thing. Yeah. And we've had some fun with it, but uh, you know, we filmed this car over the years, and it's honestly everybody knows this car. It's such a badass build. I guess let's let's go through it. So, what's the basic rundown on on the build now? Now it's the K24, K20, 2.4, uh, um, K20 C1 head, the same cams, the same everything. Uh, 76 millimeter Gary Turbo this time, 90, 76, 90, and it's on um, um, BP gas and makes about like a, a C85. Bit. Yeah, C85. We're gonna test it today. That is a massive turbo. <laughs> that That's is small, it's a small class turbo. Yeah, so it's a 76, but it's got a huge front housing on it. 76, 91. Gary Turbo. And that's, like worked, that's worked pretty well for you? Yeah, it's a little bit strong turbo, you know. Yeah. And it's, a, it's still a class turbo, believe it or not. Nice. I like it, so. Awesome. Sweet, man. You guys a shot here. So what about the fuel system? Um, it runs a, a mechanical fuel pump, a 12 gallon mechanical fuel pump, dual, uh, dual injectors, 2600 each cylinder. And that's it, it says three gallon cells in the front. Nice. I run on the street and the track, you know. Right. It's got to be in top of hands. Yeah, we, we've seen this thing uh, do a lot of work on the street and the track. Yep. <laughs> I love, I love to run on the street. Uh, this car is a little you know, dangerous to run the street because it's spinning so much sometimes, but for sure, uh, we're working on it right now, so let's see. Give you guys a shot of the interior here. So we got race car, baby. What does this thing weigh? Uh, I would say 2700 with me in it. With you in it? Yes, 2700. Like some people think these things are light. It's, it's just I mean, I would have guessed that. I would have thought it was lighter. No, nah, it has some weights, all, all the roll cage, all the safety. Yeah, it all adds, everything adds a little bit of weight, you know? Yeah, yeah. For sure. All right, so we pop the bottle there? Yeah. Uh, nitrous on, just in case. You got the, <laughs> you got the, uh, the giggle juice. <laughs> <laughs> so you use that, what, for to spool the turbo and on rolls or digs or what? So uh, usually uh, I run it between gears. If it, if it dies out, nitrous gets in. Nice. Um, also on the rolling anti lag if it, if it not if it, if it backs out, nitrous hits right there too. So. Awesome. So just a little bit of a little bit of spool help. Yeah, yeah, it help, helps a lot. Yeah. Oh yeah. Trust me. Especially with such a big turbo and yeah. and uh, you know a two four liter I guess is, is a good size for a Honda, but it's still a small engine. Twenty four. In the 20, grand scheme. Twenty four twenty. So yeah. it's pull nice, but the turbo is still big. So oh, yeah. it needs nitrous no matter what. It needs oh, it. Yeah. She needs it. And she loves it. She loves nitrous too. What's the <laughs> fastest pass in the car so far? Seven nine two one hundred and eighty seven. Wow, man. 
right now um, transmission is stronger everything is stronger now so i just waiting for the right time to go and test it nice and what's the i guess what's the most power you've put down you've been able to put down on the street whether it's been a race or just testing or what on the on the street racing about 70 pound on boost on third gear <laughs> <laughs> 70 pounds i would say that i mean that's yeah. all of it bro yeah yeah <laughs> last year that last year it, take, it takes 70 68 70 pounds and then drops to about 65 you know? that's nuts yeah. i mean that's crazy to think about because yeah. you've been almost 190 in the quarter yeah so that's i mean really if you're all in in third gear that's a, almost 190 mile an hour car yeah. on the street actually it goes a little on <laughs> the data like shows a little bit more on uh, a, a little bit more of 190 Nuts. so it's crazy but today no today we're gonna run a little bit less just in case you know, for sure it's kind of windy, windy here so yeah what do you typically set the tires to usually uh when any saw rolling they put like 12 psi in the front and 50 on the back and then when we're launching it's gonna be about a on the front and the same in the back like 10 maybe eight. nice yeah. so you run a all wagon parts on this for the all-wheel drive all system? Wagon, all wagon, all wagon. Uh, wagon start, wagon drive shaft with the all gray uh, 1320 joints in the front, on the front. And wagon biscuit cover. Wagon start differential with the LSD on it. And that's it. Uh, this is one of, one of the first cars that I made all-wheel drive. So, you know, probably on the top five, this is one of them. Yeah. So, and then transmission, you got the uh, transmission, PPG we're, dog we're, box? We're run right now a, a billet housing with the PPG 1 through 4 and uh, drag a tilt, a uh, uh, billet transfer case, drag uh, PBG uh, transfer gear, and all the stuff, all the good stuff. And the PBG uh, spider gear as well. That's, that was one of the main problems with the uh, this uh, K-series over drive. The spider gears always give up. So right now, PBG makes a nice uh, uh, spider gear, so we'll be testing. It didn't kick, yeah, yeah. No, it took a little so, bit to, so we, to we, kick in. No, it didn't work. So we're gonna try nitrous. Bro. Nitrous? We do not nitrous to see what's up. Bro, out. when third and fourth gear hits on this yeah, thing, yeah, you can feel it. <laughs> it's partying. It's been a while like, getting this car. Like you felt it, like it's going. I was slow in the beginning because it wasn't working. So we gotta check that. So we gotta check that. So let's go with nitrous to so we can spool it. Quick. So this thing goes straight as an arrow, yeah. and I mean it's it's I a light car making a ton of horsepower. This all-wheel drive stuff is. I tell you, it goes it's straight. It's legit. I tell you, yeah, it's nice. I like Jesus. it. Jesus, it's the best shit ever, mate. You know. So let's wait until cars come so we can hit, get another hit. I'm not gonna lie, my heart's pumping a little from that one. Yeah, this car's one hell of an experience. It's been a while too. I drive so. I was like scared <laughs> yeah. to miss his gear or something. So regarding luxuries, <laughs> we got uh we got the finest Kirkies in the land here. Oh yes. We got some Kirkies. We got some harnesses. We got a cage. I got the race car and the driver. Couple of uh, on the cameraman too. <laughs> a couple of buttons here. So this car is all business. Yeah. That's for sure. It's now so. It's been a while. And then again, it's loud. Get this. It's I, loud, get, bro. I get used to my other car. Like, it's, you know, still not <laughs> the shit like that. It's so loud. It's definitely not built for 
The luxuries of street driving. No, you can go to Pablo with this. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna flip this one on this pass here. The yeah, nitrous nitro, there. Nitrous on. Nitrous? <laughs> it kicks. It kicks. Between kicks. gears. And, and still between gears. It, it goes, came in instant. It, it goes on and then shut off. And it's gone and shut so off. when you run on the street, you typically hit it with nitrous, right? Between gears. Like it is running. It takes a while because nitrous kicks about 50 miles per hour. So with a 40, so I hit it, it's still, you know, Bro. take a while. But gets, the second nitrous yeah, hits, it's yeah, just. Yeah. Yeah. Once it turns, that's it. It literally <laughs> feels like three, 300 horsepower like this. Yes. Actually, it makes 300 horsepower difference on the graph. Oh. Like, it makes 200 and then we go nitrous only to spool. Once the nitrous kicks, it makes 300 horsepower different on the power <laughs> band. It's crazy. Yeah. Alright, I don't I don't say this very much in features, but uh I need to get out of this thing. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> this thing is terrifying. Okay, let's put some fuel and let's let's wait, go down a little bit. We'll do some notches. You want to do a dig? Yeah, let's do some Hell notches. yeah, bro. Like a small first, second, you know. That's why I love you, bro. You love the party. Yeah. yeah <laughs> so before I get out of this thing, a massive TRC approved stamp for this thing, dude. <laughs> dude, honestly, while I say this thing is terrifying because there's just so much happening, so many raw sounds and yeah. and the pure like nice. the the pure raw horsepower <laughs> to weight <laughs> is just insane but it goes straight as an arrow yeah it goes i tell you it goes straight, it goes right? straight as an arrow man your chip thing goes straight straight it shouldn't Bro. pull nothing My man, third, you set this car up really good i'm sorry it felt a little bit funny oh they don't want to come back like it's good it's good I have phenomenal this job with this I thing have, dude i have this thing for a while so i know I'm doing i can this. see why this car terrorizes the street so yeah. much <laughs> streaky, streaky, animal man. bro yeah. oh my god <laughs> Pressure to what you said, eight, eight pounds. If you now, now eight, eight psi for the dig. Twelve on the back, so see if we can get a good, a good launch over it. So let me ask you: at this horsepower level, does these do these blocks like to survive at this horsepower level, or where do you where do you start seeing typically certain anything issues? over thirteen hundred? The stop block cracks. Yeah, like the head gasket. They like rolling the dice. Yeah, it's it's like the head, the studs, the they don't they don't stretch because they're good material. So what happened? It brings the block and then separate the block in half. Like while well, the the studs meet, crack it right there. You see a lot of... Uh, so 1,000 to 1,100 is that sweet spot to, thousand, to beat on it? 1,000, 1,100, you good over there. Anything over 1,300, like once you hit uh, more uh, uh, like 60 pounds, that's it. You know you're in risk. Mm -hmm. so that's why we see all these guys switching over to the bill of Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Actually, the, this K series, the K series is a little stronger. Uh, B series, they, they do that a lot. Too. It's a hundred, man. But imagine, stop block, stop casing, making 1,200. The car is built, made for 200, 200 horsepower. I mean, it's crazy. Ho yeah. Horsepower per no. cylinder. Yeah. Is, How much? Is, Divide it. Is nuts. 13, uh, 12, 200. It's nuts. 200, 200 per, uh, 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 divided uh, on four is going to be six and six, 300 per cylinder. It's crazy, huh? Amazing what these little four cylinders. 300 per cylinder. What, the, what this uh, platform <laughs> has evolved to, huh? Yeah, it's crazy, huh? So for the dig stuff, what do you, what RPM do you usually launch at? 8,000. On the street? A lot of RPM. Yeah. Before with a 2.0, 2.0 engine, we run about 83, 8200 RPM, and then still bugging out. This one now, K24, makes a lot of more torque way before. So, yeah. so we we run 879, 8000 8, RPM, anti lag. Nice. How much boost typically off the line do you like? Usually to see? between, uh, I would say 16 to 20 psi. Because sometimes it goes a little bit more. If you, hold, if you hold them more, eventually it goes up, cleans yeah. up more a little bit. But I don't think less than anything more than 20, 
I'm 22. That's a good to go. Yeah. That's and that's for street setting. A street wow. or track, or track. And track too. He has uh, the, one of these Martin Oaks uh, sleep bag. Okay. Electronics. Uh, if it's box out, we can adjust it. If it's spin too much, we can adjust it. Too. And that's been working well for you. Yeah, he's doing good. Nice. That's the only thing with this always drives, you know. What clutch are you running in the car? Right now, it runs an action uh, triple disc. Uh, okay. Action clutch. It's holding it. Inside. It's been a while, so it's good. Drive shaft uh, front axles and drive shaft rear axles as well. Awesome. Too. So. Yeah. That's the best, right? Yeah, they make the best stuff there when it comes to the, the axles. <laughs> Let me drop the rear. The way it's set up, if it spins on first, the strain gauge don't work, so it won't go on second. That's it, that's it, so you can't spin. In this car, if it's limited, the, the, the uh, what's the name, the strain gauge. It messes with the, 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 strain the setting gauge, for the strain, strain gauge. gauge. Yes. Yeah. So you can't spin in this, so sometimes better, you take off easy and the RPM drops, it goes up. A little bit. Like you take off too hard, the RPM bouncing on the, on the limiter and won't go on second. That was the, the main problem with this car in the street. On the track, now we're gonna try to get the full, uh, the, the full hooks, you know, uh, over here, you gotta be careful with yeah. that. And then if you end up having to clutch it, then that's, yeah, that's, you can the, ra clutch it, then you that's can, the race. <laughs> yes, you can clutch it, but it's different. You can, it's, you need, you need the strains on this big turbo. Oh yeah. Once uh, you clutch it. Uh, the second if it, it dies out of boost and yep. Course. Right there, that's the problem right there with this. This is not like a small turbo. You can clutch it in and it will keep going, you know. Mm -hmm. You need that strain gauge, you need that boost. Oh yeah. Once you press a clutch, all that boost goes away. Now you got to build that boost back. Even with it's nitrous. It's night and day difference. Yeah, mm -hmm. definitely, yes. So if it hooks, you know, you throw gears, it would be fine. If it spins, it's bad. Yeah. Yeah, that's a bad launch right there. You got one adjustment here in the clutch. Okay. One, so let's see. Small, small, only one small. Oh, that's the Magnus? Yeah, that's a Magnus adjustment. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put it, no sleep too much. Because there's no prep, so. All right, right there, supposed to take off. <laughs> More sleep and nitrous. Yeah. Want to shift? Boop, it bucks out. But it's good. It feels a little good. Little test it, right? Well, yeah. at least going to gear is fine. Yeah, you know? right? Yeah. It looks. It looked good. Yeah. A little bit more sleep, I would say. Yeah. Like hair more. Hair yeah. more. So the RPM stays up. Oh yeah. yeah. That's nice. It works good. Sweet. Thank you, Javier. My come. man. <laughs> That was a sick launch, bro. Yeah, he had to drive it a little bit. Yeah, it came out way harder, just like he said. Yeah. So I'm gonna say, boys, there hasn't been very many times in TRC history where I've tapped out, and I was like, "No, nah, I'm good. I'm good. Those two first two hits were good." Yeah, tapping out. Yeah. That thing is the real deal for sure, bro. You see, now it's too much. <laughs> That's a, we gotta play with it. That shit Plays, left I, got, I gotta put it. I gotta put it on then. I press the clutch, it eventually gets in the limiter, and still, it was better right now, huh? Bro, I think left. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. Left, I think dude. it's ready. We're ready, <laughs> Thank you, Javier. My Thank man. you so much, man. Thank you, bro. Let's go, let's go get some Thank water. Thank you, bro. Huh? That was a hell of an experience, man. Thank you so much, bro. Right, that one was you. way yeah. more spicy than yeah. the first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's only a little bit sleep only. Yeah. I gotta go maybe half turn, you know, so you can sleep less. Yeah, man. That's a, you gotta play a little oh, bit. Yeah. Yeah. So what's next with the car? Next, we go inside of the testing and eventually run it on the street and the track, whatever. Yeah, we're, trying to have, we're trying to have fun with this thing. Oh, yeah. We don't care, you know? It's built to that. So have fun. Like it is right now, we'll kill anything in the street. Hell yeah, bro. Anything. Anything. <laughs> All right, bro. Here we go. That's the official call out. All right, thank you, bro. Call out? <laughs> right now? No, no, no that's no, the. Really. <laughs> so I want to give a shout out to my man and my main guy, Javi Toon. He's the one that made this possible, run the car hard. 
and my people from the League Ratch, and that's it. That's it. That's it.